to a boat here. That's a who. I want to organize my nice day. I'm about to look up a uh, catered in. My dad just said I look like a catered in. <laughs> Shrimp taco. Get the crutches for the B-roll. That I was feeling you. What's that, T? Let me get some of that. Ooh! Yeah, that is, that's that. Come on, break it down. Break it down, yeah. He like, why are you sleep already? Get it to it. <laughs> they ain't never stopped me from pulling up to Red Lobster, though. More of a... But she don't even care. Nope. Cause she liked it there. Like it. Pretty women all around me, cause I'm the young Hugh Kelf. <laughs> and that's just how I live. Bunny and pretty women. Okay, then. Um, all around the world. Don't you get Yes. Thank you. Okay, so I'm gonna sit in here and wait versus going back to the car I may as well. The salad is for me, but I got the around the world pizza, so I'm about to go and see my dad. Mr. Link is still at school, but I also wanted to check on Boom. If y'all saw, like, she on crutches and her leg is just like all messed up. It's not my business to tell, but. Oh, you see the salad too? <laughs> no, fine. The salad, the dressing set, and everything is okay, in for thank you. you. It was Jordan. I remember Our you, you know, when yeah. was vlogging. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> you came in here with your son. Say that again. You came in here with your son? Oh, yeah, my nephew. Yeah. Oh, that was your nephew? Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. I remember when you gave us your card. Yeah. <laughs> you gave us your YouTube channel because I looked it up. Oh, did you like it? I did. Cool. Thank you so much. I remember I watched you get your nails done or something. I forgot where you were, but I watched your YouTube video. You went out to eat. The food or something smelled like a, what was it? I probably said something Windex crazy. or something. Oh yeah. <laughs> I can't remember where you were at. Good everybody. seeing y'all again. I Thank you so much. I put pepper in there just in case, but you okay. have four things of parmesan. So Thank you so much. You're welcome. First off, so that's going to fall. Yeah, I try. <laughs> See y'all next time. My mama coming in, I'm finna scare her. It's me. I'm about to die. Let me find something to delete. We gotta soak these nails off today too. And I brought my laptop to finish my editor. I feel like I don't know if X Lines is local. Is X Lines like anywhere else? Comment down below if you live somewhere else. All around the world. Hold on, let me get that sticky. Oh no, damn, I'm just vlogging. You can you can come in the shot. Ooh, look at it. Yeah, get it too. Ooh, I ain't gonna eat that. That is too cute to eat. I'd be so in the moment talking to people, I forgot to ask them if they wanted to be on camera or if they wanted to say hey. I had gave them a car last time I was in there. I should have turned my purse off. Ow. <laughs> well, this is my favorite salad. Ain't nobody giving them a run for their money. Zaxby's got a good salad too. But they did something a little different. The cheese. The cheese was sitting on top of the pizza. I never ordered both of them at the same time. So this is the salad. This is the grilled chicken salad that I get, and you get so much chicken. Like, it comes with the egg, but the peppers, your olives. Oh, I love when they give me two, and then they give you crackers as well. Anybody else to believe in So, yeah, I crunch these up in my salad as well. Okay, let me grab to fix my sister plate. I went upstairs to just check on her, and I was like, You woke? You wanna eat? A one, a two. I know that ain't my phone again. A three. How many slices you want, Dad? Who finna get in the pool? It's 103. You Yeah, you know, I stay with my spinning night bag. I got my swimsuit. Yeah, I'll turn it off. Oh, it look good. There you go, Dad. Which one of mine? That's 
Yeah, what you want? I don't want one right now. This thing on your fire, your pizza. I brought this for y'all. I got a salad. Oh. Uh, if you're new here, I'm very family oh, oriented. I might hit the food. Welcome. We got the oil changed. Life's good. I feel like getting up. Watch out, bro. Girl, not the fan. You mom, you blowing out my stuff, Ma. 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 Girl, she's trying to get the aesthetic going and she blowing out my stuff everywhere. Not that I forgot to put it on Instagram. Who cares about Insta? I like that little thing. Yeah. Watch out. I'm trying to film. He want to be all in the shot. Just take a picture. Yeah, get into the party and shit. I be having too much footage. Yeah, that's cool. Chicken! I like to eat those separately. Lisa is placing her order. Thank God for your help to spend that wow. wow. over <laughs> Get my reaction. <laughs> Dad! <laughs> oh, his eyes. He wish he looked like me. <laughs> my dad told me his eyes. I look so bald, I got a puff today. But you know what? I want, I want a picture of him like this. You can this. show me the way he eyes. Eyes. That's what he's talking about, praying mantis. That's why I feel you somebody praying mantis. Oh, no. Show me, Glenn. A praying yeah, mantis can never. Show me. Show me. My dad is so funny. I need to put that charcoal away. I feel like it's been sitting there for four days now. Hey, y'all. So, this me. So, today is Thursday. And I'm getting ready to head out. My cute little maxi dress is from Walmart. It's got the cute little slits on both sides. So, I made sure my leg is like glowing and giving it to the girls. Little flippy flops with this. Let me see what this brand is. Vince Camato. I got my necklace back. Or if you saw the previous vlog my earrings and then I just my hair needs to be washed so we did this little look together on Instagram live and I leave out little playful cute little pieces right here I'm gonna take my Burberry shades with me as well and that's the look so I'm getting ready to go by the post office because I got one of the sorry we missed you slips a couple of days ago a couple of weeks ago I'm hoping that it's my stuff from Bottega that's the only thing I could think of is something that I've been waiting on from them I also need to grow it's dead it's gonna die I got the other battery and then hold on and then I also need to I'm gonna meet up with my sister bone she's got an appointment yep I did leave that light on glad I came back up here so I'm either going to go with her um, to her appointment at two o'clock so let's head out I've just always kind of been like a quality over quantity type of person for one and for two this side of it is what makes it weird because then you have to question people's motives when it comes to them wanting to be cool with you in the first place because it's like why you want to be my friend I mean before YouTube I was a why you want to be my friend type of person but with this now it really makes it like as far as new people it really makes it like uh, and you give like a side eye because people don't be genuine like I said remove YouTube out the picture people still don't be genuine but this just makes it even more difficult so most of the people that I know I've been on them 
Cause people start calling, oh, all of that, like don't call me all of destiny. If we're friends, why are you calling me that? I don't like it. Ugh. It's just difficult. I'm just disappointed that I took so long to notice that slip that now I don't even know what that is or where it's at or if it got sent back. There's nothing in my email. I didn't order anything that would need a signature. Like the only thing I could think of is the Bottega, the chain that the guys were been mailing, but wouldn't they email you something saying that it's coming? I would assume. And maybe they're like, oh, she'll just sign for it. I wasn't there to sign for it. So I Anyways, it's just sad. All right, hey y'all, so I'm out. <laughs> I'm all showered up and everything from way earlier. It's like super late now. It's like seven o'clock at night. Um, I'm getting ready to watch Carisha Please. Carisha Please with Lotto. Big Lotto, big remix. But man, I'm gonna get ready to get something to eat. Well, some leftovers. Mine's done, let me get it. It's cold. Dang. I don't like it too, too hot. Let me check. Cause you gotta. <laughs> that went on today off camera i went with my sister uh bone to her doctor visit um she did do some documenting over there so y'all can check her channel if y'all want to know about all of that um as far as her leg being like messed up and stuff um what else oh about the post office because i didn't cut the camera back on after that they don't know where my package is i took too long to go up there so as far as the uh um, like the, the time that they'll hold a package for either it got sent back or they don't like they just don't have it or couldn't find it. I don't know what it could have been. And that's why I was talking about the Bottega thing. If y'all saw when I went to Dallas and I was trying to inquire about getting another chain for the one that I popped, um, they make those chains to order and the chain length that you get is based on the shoe size that you have, like custom um, for each shoe size. Only thing else for today is watch a Carisha Please. I already had my shower and washed off. Well, I only did brows today, but I already washed my face, did my skincare routine. This is like a leftover slice of pizza that I brought home from my folks' house. What's that, T? Let me get some of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, get it to it. We can watch Carisha, please. One of my predictions that they're gonna talk about is about her changing her name from Mulatto to Lotto. Big Lotto. Big Lotto. Big remix. Mm -hmm. Big bags. Big bands. Big cup of juice. But yeah, I will talk to you all tomorrow. I was just sitting the camera over here to put it on the charger station. And I want to conclude, because I hate when I don't really I don't do a good job of concluding day to day today. So I'm ready to go because I already took my contacts out. So I don't even know what I'm looking at. Brad your destiny say hey. Bye. So listen, thought I was feeling you. <laughs> I am dressed in my workout clothes because it's Friday. We're supposed to go work out. Um, but I got a they haven't responded, hang tight text. Not me seeing messages and just not replying. I'm terrible. I said, don't judge me. So, what was you saying? Yeah, so I'm all showered up and dressed. Oh, I know what I don't have on deodorant. So I'm glad that I that. No. Anyway, let me get y'all the backstory. So we were going to go work out. But the text that I got said, hang tight. Haven't heard anything back yet. I'm already dressed. Basically was ready and all of that. So... I had my breakfast and I was sitting down getting ready to reply to emails. I combed my hair, all of that. And I had chose a time in my head. I said, if I don't hear back by this time, I'm going to go ahead and start my day. I'm at Walmart because I want to deep condition my hair before I braid it down. I don't know why I'm going to braid it down and I ain't going to even wear the wig that long. I need to do a wig review. I've been sitting on this wig review for a few months now. <laughs> I ain't going to even say the company hates me because they don't. <laughs> then I'm also going to just kind of browse the beauty section for a few other things that I want to grab. Somebody wanted me to do like a beauty supply store, a little TikTok type of video where you just show yourself shopping and show what you get. So if I film it for TikTok instead, I'm going to just have to do the haul when I get home because I don't... Y'all know it takes too long to get both clips because... YouTube is widescreen 16 by 9 and then vertical like this for when you film a TikTok or an Instagram reel. Did I tell y'all we reached 100,000 subscribers on Instagram? I probably didn't say anything because I wanted to wait until we passed it before mentioning it. But we reached 100,000 subscribers on Instagram so make sure you follow me over there. I'm going to be doing a giveaway on Instagram soon. It's going to have nothing to do with YouTube. Yeah, you can't enter over here. It's going to be on Instagram. It's for my Instagram followers. 
separate from this this right here uh, if you follow me on instagram then shout out to you and thank you for your love and support i'm gonna crimp my hair i think and i want to soak my nails off as well but since my nails have grew like really long under here i need to hurry up because this camera began hot in the dash and then it just cut off in the middle that's so annoying i actually want to wait until after i braid my hair down so that i don't start getting hang nails and then ruin the length like see how long this one is so we're gonna do that as well and I want a fresh pedicure. I ain't saying I'm gonna do all of this in one day. When y'all watch my maintenance videos, that stuff does not happen in the same day. Like, it doesn't. If I was going to get it done, it could because I'm relaxing. But with doing it myself, you're not gonna catch me giving myself a pedicure and some acrylic nails in the same day. Don't talk to me. Okay, Paul, so I'm randomly over here because I needed to get an ice cream scooper. And they have a whole Joey section. I did not know that. I normally get the Joey products at like Home Goods or like TJ Maxx or something. So now I gotta look and see what the Joey products they got that I don't. Ice ball. Oh my god! A burger press. I love the egg ring. It's so fun. It keeps your egg like perfectly round. Oh, look at the mini condiments. I don't need that one. What's this? Oh, it's an egg slicer. Ooh. Tea cook. I don't make that kind of tea. Spreaders, too colorful. I have one of these. Oh, wait, what's this? The reusable bags. What is this? Get me! Squeeze and pour citrus juice. So I have everything for my little TikTok video. Well, I didn't get these items for the TikTok. I needed the items, so I filmed the TikTok. <laughs> Alright, so I made it back home. Got my little thing on to kind of snatch my double chin. I'm going to start back wearing it when my hair is like and a style that enables me to wear it. When I'm wearing high puffs, I can't do it. So I'm sitting down editing now. I filmed seven minutes worth of TikTok content. I think you can post three minutes to TikTok. Um, so if that's where I could chop it down to, that's what I'm gonna use. But if I can get it down to a minute, that would be great. Since I filmed it on this camera, actually, I put the files into Final Cut. And then when you go to project, I select vertical. So that it's like vertical, basically, like the full length of the phone. Um, so basically I kind of sit here and I pull out the important parts. I add sharpness to my videos and then if I want to keep the audio, I just pull out the parts when there's the sound that I need for it to give like an ASMR type of vibe. So since like TikTok, Instagram, all of these different sites have programmed people's attention spans to be super short, I just kind of like try to get straight to it. As opposed to my long vlogs, I mean you still want to get to it, but when it comes to TikTok and Instagram, I try to just give the main part before people just be like next <laughs> i want to go ahead and get this out by like noon so we'll do the haul after that and then i'm gonna probably work out and then start on my hair i'm gonna do that like maintenance style since i need to soak off my nails and do a pedicure that'll be like a separate video okay so i want to give y'all a quick example this is a main clip i'm gonna let y'all watch this clip raw as is to see like beginning and end so when you cut the camera on most times you're trying to position it right all right, so I'm going up for it, but then I was like, okay, I'm not like all the way straight. So I wanted to make sure I'm straight. It's in the middle. I grab it, wait on it to focus, and then I put it in the basket. So that little clip alone is kind of long. So part of me getting it all set up, drag, 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 drag. Oh, y'all can't see what. So down here is my timeline. So I'm just going to like cut and drag and take all of that out because I don't need any of that. And then I'm going to wait until I'm right lined up on it like this when it was perfect how I need for it to be. Oh, another thing I like to do, I click this little button um, for color correction and all of that. So I just tap that, click balance color. You may not see, but it makes kind of a difference to it. And then if I want to manually do it, I can go over there. But anyway, we'll set it for another time. So grabbing it, boom. So now I've picked it up. Coming right back to when it's in frame, over the basket. And then I put it in the basket. That's the last sound. So now we have this, a much more short version. Watch. And even that's kind of too long still. So I could like... Another thing you could do is speed it up fast. And put it in four times. So now it gives you this. Yeah, and this is another clip where you kind of prop it up. I got to go beat it. Like, whenever y'all see us looking and shopping like this, we have to prop the camera up and then walk away. But we take that out because we know y'all wouldn't want to see that part. So you drag that out and then the clip will start like this instead. 
to where I'm already over here looking and shopping. And that's just a clip for me to be in the frame of my TikTok so people will know like that it's my TikTok. Y'all yeah, look good in this. I'm sorry, like girl, I look good. You can tell me working out. Look, she looking slim on that. Okay, I'm gonna go. <laughs> So yeah, that's what I do basically. And even cutting out that much where I told you all it was seven minutes at first. I look crazy, but we do what we gotta do. Um, I've already got it down to six minutes and 20 seconds. So I basically keep repeating that. And then I export it and I send it directly to my phone. And that's how I can put it on TikTok. I can also put it on Instagram if I wanted to. I could let it be a YouTube short. You could have filmed this on your phone. Obviously you could do TikToks on your phone. I prefer it on my camera since I have the vlog camera. And then as far as getting the verticals, I'm gonna have to show y'all in the mirror so y'all can see. So when I'm filming vertical for TikTok or for Instagram, this little side right here, um, I put the camera to where it's inside of that. And then it makes it this way. So if I wanted to use this for TikTok or Instagram, now it's vertical like how I need and I can still sit the legs like on the shelf and stuff like that in the store if I wanna see while I'm filming to make sure as I walk away on my frame, I can let my viewfinder up like that. So. Yeah. And then when I need to be back on YouTube, do it like this. Okay, so I'm going to show you all what I got from Walmart. Two bags. Now, my fact that the total was $111. I don't see it. <laughs> no particular order. Come on with the double bag. Um, I glanced the entire little hair tool section. This was the only crimper I saw or like waiver. So it's the double ceramic waiver by conair it says they have new smaller packaging for deep waves it at least gets up to 400 degrees so i feel like this should be good and it's cute like the color on it the white but like the rose gold i needed it now i don't got time to wait on shipping and all of this hair stopper for when i wash my hair to catch the hair yeah i compared the prices on them so this was like the best price that they had um just an ice cream scooper and i like this one because it has like the release i broke my ice cream scooper I don't want to talk about it. It broke. Uh, the Neutrogena Soothe and Calm. This packaging, like the way this shampoo and conditioner looks, it just caught my attention. So I got the shampoo and the conditioner, the Soothe and Calm one um, for dry scalp of hair. I like these. I can't say I like them. I just got them. I never used them before. But they, it says that they have tea tree oil. So shampoo and conditioner. And I wanted to re-up on my hair products too. Like, I try not to be a hoarder, but I love to have a good stash of products when it comes to doing my hair scrunchies these get lost so i always feel like i'm buying scrunchies i like these because they're thick like me <laughs> and these are like the ouchless ones um my hair is actually in one of these right now and then a rubber band once i do the little ball part pretend that i don't got a bunch of edge brushes already but this one no this one is different like this is the edge brush i used to do my hair this morning i have to boil it i boil these with shampoo to clean out your hair tools but this one is only brush and comb, right? So the difference. Look at that. We got brush. We got comb. This looks like you scoop your product out with that. And then you got another mini light comb on the other side. Don't talk to me. This one is a four in one. Get into it. But now the clips. So whenever y'all see my hair in like, where it's kind of falling in my face a little bit and it's real big and poofy, that's not a scrunchie. For that kind of hairstyle, you want a banana clip. I literally only have one banana clip. The same one that I've been using for years, probably all the way back to like high school days. I just never lost it, still had it. It wasn't broken. I keep using it. But I finally picked up more banana clips. I say clip. This says combs. And then the clear and the black. I like cotton rounds. I always get the Equate brand. Um, I use these to soak off my nails, to sometimes sanitize my phone, put alcohol on it. I also use these like with my Ambi toner, mist it over the face, wipe down your face. The cotton rounds are just multi-purposed um, and this is like the best price to just use them for that and trash them. 100 count. My little thing is not empty but I wanted some more. So I got the got to be free spray to basically do my wig with. <laughs> if I had some I would have put it on this hairstyle to actually make it lay down. You can see like the little flyaways and then you tie it down for a few seconds while you finish getting ready. So they changed the packaging but when I had relaxed hair I used to use this hair mayo by uh, organics the hair mayo that's what it used to be right there with the green top I like this and the formula is most likely still the same I can tell if I smell it let me see oh that just reminded me of when I used to get my relax y'all remember I used to get my relax I used to say finna get their relaxer girl they thought I was going natural girl or something like that but now I am natural so I'm getting to it <laughs> this packaging caught my attention I never used this before either it's the suave sulfate free cleansing shampoo 
gently cleanses and moisturizes. This one has natural shea butter and coconut oil. I like to use the whole line because I be feeling like it's formulated to work together. Moisturizing curl conditioner as the shampoo and the curl defining cream. We can't use this right now because I'm getting ready to wash my hair down for a wig. So I may wash with these two for the time being, the tea tree ones. And then when I go back to my curls, we're gonna give that little line a try. Three more things and then I'm done. This is the Sally Hansen cuticle rehab. I like to keep a cuticle pen on me. I just like the look of having your cuticles moisturized. Like if you're trying to take a nail picture or you're showing something like I'm showing y'all things right now, your nails could be cute, but if the cuticle's dry, it's not giving what it needs to give. So this one is gonna stay in my purse, use immediately when I finish my nails. But since I'm getting ready to soak these off because I'm missing two on this hand and the thumb came off, I'm sick of looking at this. I got this nail hardener. They had two different ones and I was trying to see cause I'm like, okay, they say the exact same thing. But the only difference is this one is like a rosy tint. So if y'all can see it's kind of pink like that. So when you put it on the nails, it's gonna give you like a little bit of like a sheer pink type of look. I still need to either go to Ulta or Sephora, but I wanna kinda have a list when I go because I am like running out of makeup products. Now makeup is not something that I'll have like a lot of. Like I got a few little palettes, a few little foundations, but for the most part, the items that I use, they're constantly in rotation. This is gonna be my first time trying this one. I like the packaging. It says that you're getting two times the original one, the poreless face primer. I wonder if they're giving you two times for the same price. Is it $10? Yeah, it's $10. I can't remember, I think, did it used to be eight? I don't know, but I got the Elf. Come on, folks. Did y'all see that? Boom. <laughs> so that's everything I got. And I'll talk to you all a little bit later. If I don't pick the camera back up, then I'll talk to you all tomorrow instead. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's get some B-roll going. Them, they're so foul, like and pretty. Oh, I like how they switched the bow out too. Normally it's like pink bows, this orange now for fall. I actually just finished my workout and I was going to have, let me show y'all. Oh, I got seven minutes to shower. I was trying to like be done at the same time. So these are the cauliflower wings, but these are garlic parmesan. I never had the garlic parmesan ones before. Y'all, they got air fry instructions on the back now get into it so that's supposed to go for 16 minutes we're behind a little bit and i had a really good workout by the way this week i am three for three monday wednesday friday yeah period <laughs> i just came out of the beauty supply store i would have took you all in but i don't go to this one that often um, people be worried about recording the one i used to go to before i moved they were like very familiar with the fact that i did youtube so it was never a big deal i got this canvas head Depending on the style, it's easier to do it like on a stand and then put it on and like do finishing touches. I wanna make sure though, cause she's got this different stand in there, a larger one before I pull off. Oops. I gotta put it together, but this is the part I wanted to double check. Cause they got the actual stand, but this kind, um, it's just a mannequin holder. It's just like in a little box. Everybody at the beauty spot store on a Saturday morning be giving the same thing, like, I'm about to do my hair. Don't look at me. Yes, I got on this scarf. Yes, I got on this hat. Yes, I got on this bunny. Well, a lot of people in there had on bunnies, but I'm not a bunny in the store kind of girl. So I just wear a hat instead. No disclaimers, but I know how people get so teachers on, do whatever you like. I just prefer a hat over a bunny. In my last video, y'all was like, what's wrong with this? What's wrong with that? <laughs> when I was doing my makeup and we were all on the phone, like, on FaceTime and things like that. My brother was making fun of my sister for using like her taco kit that she used. And people was like, what's wrong with that? And I said something about not, not like not preferring to dress casual because I struggle when it comes to getting dressed casually. Like dressing up is easier for me when I go to my closet. And people were in the comments like, what's wrong with dressing casual? And I'm like, I'm speaking of I. In English, when you had to highlight the main part of a sentence, the main part would be I. I said, I don't like to dress casual. 
the discussion was never about whether somebody else likes something or not. Like, if you like it that much, my opinion should not affect you still liking it. People can talk about shrimp being the roaches of the sea and seafood is nasty and I don't see how y'all eat that and I ain't got time to crack no crab leg. They ain't never stopped me from pulling up to Red Lobster though. So, more of Moral of the story being, if you like something, keep liking something. Don't allow nobody to not make you like what you like. Cause the girls can never make me not like seafood because I still love it. Don't let nobody's opinion of their preference affect whether you still like something or not. Whether that's me or anybody. Do you boo? Hey y'all, it's all of Destiny. So happy Sunday. Just finished my editing. I filmed like, I basically I went to Dollar Tree and I filmed like a video kind of just shopping unlimited little spree. I just went overboard in Dollar Tree. So I just finished editing that video. I sat down to film it and then I got like straight up, went upstairs to go and edit. Yeah, I basically got to clean up the whole mess. So definitely make sure you all check out that video. Um, but I'm getting ready to clean everything up and then I'm gonna put the camera on charger while I clean all of this up. And then we're gonna try this together, the mac and cheese from that video. Cause I'm curious to try it. And I'm about to dump this actually in the candy bowl right now. And I got the big popcorn thing. Like I can use that to see the camera on for a second. It's about to die as we speak. So yeah, Sunday has been pretty good. It's almost like six o'clock, almost six or seven o'clock. So I'm gonna tidy everything up and then just have some me time and kind of get ready to chill, watch a movie and relax. So I guess we'll actually start the vlog on tomorrow since I just spent all day editing. So I recently went through my closet cause I was just putting away clothes and then that turned into me like going through my clothes. This is like trash stuff. This is some stuff that I'm probably gonna give away. I got this one from Dollar Tree if y'all saw the video. So I'm finna plug it in. People staring, standing around. Hello, hi, good morning. So today is Tuesday, 9-19 basically. So I've been up for a little while now and I did the thing that you should not do when you first get up. I started scrolling TikTok and I saw these nightstand videos where people are like showing how they organize their nightstands. I watched like 15 of them. So I jumped up and I went and looked in the pantry. It's like a shelf in the pantry where I keep extra organization bins that haven't been used yet. So I found these two. I know y'all gonna ask where they are from. I don't even know, I just found them in there. Uh, <laughs> I was trying to look at the labels and stuff, but it's not on here anymore. They might be from container store or just, I don't know. But they have these little grips in them and I was like, let me see if I got some containers. So we're probably not gonna do both of the, both of the nightstands today, but we're gonna do the one just over here on the side that I sleep on the most. I wanna organize my nightstand and get it like aesthetically pleasing. Not even aesthetically pleasing, but it is pleasing to just have it organized and clean for me to be able to go in there and get what I need. That's the aesthetic, to find what you want. Um, a lot of you all ask me what I film my Instagram reels and my TikToks with. Most of the time, a lot of the videos that you all see, I do film them on my DSLR. I've had this way long before Instagram and TikTok became like you know the little instagram reels and all of that so i use this because i just already have it since i'm a youtuber but you can use your phone um and then i edit them inside of final cut if i'm filming something away from home and i want to make a video and i need some vertical shots then i'll just do it on the sony if that's what i have i just don't know how to edit that people be asking me and it's just like how do i feel myself edit like what what y'all want to know anywho so this is the nightstand i'm gonna keep it short on tiktok but at least over here on youtube i'm gonna film myself kind of tidying up this space so this is exactly how i left it last night i love pistachios so i kind of have these when i watch the movies and stuff so the tiktok starts off basically with you kind of showing the nightstand the next clip is where you pull the drawer out and organize it so i do have a bottom section down here too but y'all don't need to see the bottom one <laughs> and then some of the items that i got from dollar tree if y'all saw that video i was gonna open up and put in here as well so y'all get the longer vlog version over here if y'all want to see the finished look on my instagram and tiktok most likely by the time y'all see this it'll be up so because sometimes i'll sit in my bedroom and put my lotion on at the end of the night I like my blessed oil right here i actually had one in here i don't know what happened to it i used to have one in here as well so i'm gonna just put this blessed oil in here uh, blessed oil is just like an anointed oil um if you're curious you know how like people sell these like in the middle aisles of the mall i try to like support their businesses because it's usually like their own business so this one is inspired by baccarat actually i don't know if it like actually smells like it I need to get some more clinics too 
This is that little pocket cologne that I got from Dollar Tree. This smells so good. If you see this, grab it. And then this is just the cord to my phone. It's like plugs on the back of my nightstand. This is one of the reasons I chose this one. The lamp plugged in. This one is the, the bass. Like when you're watching movies and stuff or listening to music and you want like a boom, boom, boom. That's that. My brother got me this for Christmas actually with the matching uh, sound bar. And then I got two USBs. Liquid gold that I'm going to use to just polish it up. fact that I woke straight up and was looking at that and like oh I want to do it let me get up and do it but I have to do things when I'm in the mood like the plug was a little dusty too I should have did I made all of this the real so now that that's clean I'm gonna decide what things I put back I wanted to keep these out to like actually remember to read them but I feel like that's too many I'm gonna put the rest underneath the nightstand So I'm going to add my Pharrell Rocher's back. This is the container that they actually came in. I want to do this because realistically, this is what I use. Like when I sit down. Uh, wait, where's the other one? The Thermoplex. And then it would be like that. What I want to do is move my sunflowers. Y'all can see the sun is coming in more over here than over there and i know sunflowers need sun i also went through my drawers the other day i gotta figure out because if i can't find the bronze these go to all of these about to get thrown out let's see how that looks like if i was to do so we could give the girls this or we could give the girls this now aesthetic wise that's much cuter but now i'm gonna work to you for this and i actually need it mm. and then i need my tissue box as well when i get my tissue back let me see hold on let's swap it or we could go with this i'll be forever switching it up so i'm just gonna leave it like this for now even though i like the flower on that side okay let's let's do what we came here for the nice stand <laughs> well this is the nice stand but the inside of it because i'm stretching this out longer than it would have been if i wasn't filming i would be done I was going to be able to use this but i don't have room for it maybe i could do it on the other nightstand okay so let's do everything by category okay a few snacks that i'm going to put in this is everything that's kind of like nail care and then just like a lotion some gum i like to sanitize my phone before bed so these are the um cleaning wipes for you to just wipe your electronics down medicine related uh not really though <laughs> what i would need in bed some vapor rub aquaphor the triple antibiotic i keep this like if i wore like fake earrings for the day sometimes behind the ears they just feel a little funny and then these i got in miami um i was in a car wreck in 2020 and my knees they just sometimes they kind of give me problems sometimes they don't it just depends but this is like menthol um and i just kind of rub it on my knees and it makes them feel so much better my prayer box i want y'all to see because it's kind of personal but i write little notes inside of this and then i actually date them and then i put it in my prayer box chapsticks um perfume that i love this one is from the beauty supply store it smells really good if you like sweet scents you'll like that and just some pins masks that i don't really wear but yeah i got it from dollar tree so and then this is a little perfume as well so that should go with this um i think i'm gonna get one more perfume to put in here so let's put everything back i gotta cut the camera back on in order to get both angles, I'm sitting y'all on top of these. I need to open this for Instagram Reel too. All right, let's do it. And then this one is from Dollar Tree. I had this for a very long time. I'm not gonna throw it out just because it's kind of old looking. It still serves a purpose.
I just went upstairs to edit the TikTok and the Instagram reel, um, but I don't like what I have. So I'm going to keep the vlog version because that I'm pretty sure looks okay. Um, but I'm about to refill the TikTok and the Instagram reel. Basically, whenever I do vertical videos, I put it on both because yeah <laughs> but at least i'll be able to go a little bit quicker since i know where i want to put everything and try to just get a better angle than what i had i'm trying to decide if i should do it on the sony for this one i just feel like my hand was in the way on a lot of the clips i should have tested that first i don't always have to refilm but sometimes it does happen okay let's take everything out and start over i think what i'm going to do because i saw some people they do theirs like this then they put it in the drawer i think i'm gonna do that because that way people can actually see the items that are in there like i like how close this looks and then i'll put it away doing the other stuff in there so i didn't post that reel yet but i finished my work for the day as far as um some other things go and i want to go and get some tacos moisturizing body milk so that's on my arms and then all over the rest of my body is the dove pampering care body lotion the perfume that i just put on is the miss dior i may put the small one in my purse but i don't have that many areas to run um i've just been wanting to go to this little taco spot for like the longest so I'm about to do that. I'm going to take you all with me. It's like a solo date. So y'all don't like when I say that because I'm not alone. Y'all be like, you with us. And then my nephew's birthday is tomorrow. So I have a few things in mind that I want to grab him. Um, I should have grabbed it yesterday. You now you have your days where you're like, okay, I feel like running errands today or just being inside versus outside. And I was outside yesterday, but it just wasn't that kind of outside. Oh, that's what I didn't tell you all yesterday. I got so much taken care of. Finally, I would have taken the camera, but I was getting like some behind the scenes type of business things done with like taxes and uh, different things like that. So we did get that taken care of yesterday. And then I spent some time with my sister Boone and some other things. I can't even remember my day. That's crazy. Cause I didn't vlog it <laughs> and I didn't really post much to my story. But yeah, let's go and eat. My wig look a little crazy too. Time for it, just for like a glow. I just want some tacos. And the pictures look nice online too. I didn't do too many rings or any, well no rings actually. Since my nails are not done, I didn't want to draw too much attention to my hands. I'm kind of like a rings when the nails are done type of girl. Pandora bracelet. My necklace that I got for my 31st birthday. So yeah. I made it. I can never see my camera with these on. <laughs> oh my God. All right, so I made it to the taco spot. Fingers crossed that they're not crowded because like going alone that's gonna make me like yeah not really because i used to eat like by myself all the time like when i was in college and then after that younger me if i wanted something to eat and it was like i want it right now not to say that you don't have anybody to come with you but it's not like mandatory that you have to ask somebody by the time you ask and then they set a different time but you ready to eat when you ready to eat i don't want to wait I want to go like immediately <laughs> never mind the fact that i really only asked like two people but um they got other stuff going on and like i said my taste buds one my taste buds one and it's tuesday i don't never do taco tuesday so let's go eat i'm not gonna be able to vlog long they're playing music okay, so i got the this is the pineapple drink that they make in-house let's try it shrimp taco and this is the fish taco mine's is red snapper and then i also got the small street rice oh it's a dope okay i should have said the other way for better lighting i wonder if that's hot Okay, that's hot. Oh my god. Ooh. Yeah, the music's too loud. And everybody's looking. <laughs> Straight right spot. Mm. It's not given, it's bland. Continues to eat. just like a little chill little local spot so i'm not gonna like location tag or do anything like that but it was good i liked it um 
Hmm. The shrimp taco to me tastes better than the fish taco. With it being my first time, I kind of wanted to get like a little bit of not like two shrimp tacos and you know kind of mixing it up a little bit next time i'm gonna definitely no next time i'm not gonna get the shrimp tacos i'm gonna try something different again i'm gonna get one more shrimp taco to make sure just in case if i don't like the other thing i really didn't finish the entire fish taco because it wasn't that good to me i don't know i think me eating the shrimp one first it was like nah i want another one of these so i was just like i didn't care by the time i ate the fish one i wanted another shrimp the street rice I didn't think I would eat the entire thing, but I did because I got the smile. I have I had breakfast today? That's why you ate all your food. I didn't have breakfast today. Today's Tuesday, so I hadn't eaten anything yet. So yeah, a successful Taco Tuesday, my first solo taco date. Like getting out and just like going to get what I wanted without feeling like you have to kind of have someone to do it with you. Wow, I smell like the taco place. And I got another spot to go to. So this is the Dior uh lip gloss and delight it's a, it's kind of cool today i think it's in the 70s let me see i gotta do my nails i don't know if i want to do them tonight or what because my nephew birthday tomorrow yeah it's 76 wow let me get some gum oh this is the last piece of gum i got in the car my nice stand all cute i can't wait to use my stuff out of my clean nice stand tonight so i just made it now to walmart i'm about to make this vlog public this one right here uh really quick it's like 30 minutes i hate making them public when i'm not like able to respond but i'm going home after this so i'll be able to kind of chat with you all plus that'll give y'all time to watch the video before i start responding i may get something that's kind of complimentary to what my sister uh boom already got for him she just sent us pictures in the group already yeah mr lee you're about to be six. Oh my god I used to call him Precious Baby. Now when I respond to his school pictures, when my sister sent his school pictures to me, and I be about to say, <laughs> y'all can tell if I'm coming up, like why I sound like this? I need to grab some immunity shots while I'm in there too. I can tell when I don't have the digestion shots, this lady looking at me, she don't see the camera in the dash. <laughs> they so funny in the group, I gotta catch up. What was I saying? Uh, if you weren't talking so much with side conversation. Yeah, when I want to reply to the messages when my sister sends me pictures. Oh, she tweezing her hair out of her chin. I need to be... Oh, okay. I be, I be almost about to say precious baby, but I'm like, no, like... Mr. Lincoln is not a baby anymore. We are not in Kansas anymore. Ugh, I hate vlogging when I'm by myself. I need a cameraman to say, hey, I'm going shopping. Come meet me. I don't understand it. Like, how are they? How are they already bad? Apparently, no one don't got a label. Let me not take that up to the front. Remember what she did to me last time. <laughs> I mean, we could just go across the street to the park right here. Okay, I was getting ready to head to the next section, but both of these are cute. This, well, to me, and this. What are the colors they got? Mm -mm. It's giving cream. It's giving this right here. I'm sorry, this looks fun. <laughs> this looks so fun. I know it's all animated, so it's probably not even like that for real. But for like a six year old, it definitely would be. <gasps> and they got the cars. There's too many options. over here to like the gaming section my nephew is getting a game so i'm gonna find him 
Uh, something to go with it. They don't have a lot of options. Star Wars. What's Sack Boy? I wonder if he would like that. Sack Boy. Yeah. I was trying to find like a racing game because he likes cars. I'm gonna call y'all back. I'll show you what I decide. Do you know anything about that one? Would it be good for a six year old? Uh. Is it like pretty? Yeah. Pretty? Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna double check because some of these side board games that they have made were not really kid friendly. Oh wow, so I didn't kids know kids that. Friendly. Okay. There's, there were, they used to. Not be. I know that they made movies about this that wasn't kid friendly. Okay. Yeah, it's ready for you for everyone. Okay. So, cool. Yeah. So Thank you. You can get that. Or yeah, that's, that's the one. only one. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. You have to pay for it up front. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay, so we got the game, Sack Boy. It says ready to eat for everyone. I gotta pay for the front because whoever was in the back left. So <sighs> I'm just trying to think of if I need anything else. Not me slumped over the basket. <laughs> oh, this is cute. Oh, look at the file decor. Oh no, I like this. Oh, it's not lights in it. I feel like this would be cute in my bedroom, but they only have one. Hey. Okay, I'll come back. Wait. Oh my God, no. This is cute. Look at the little pumpkins. But I want to plan out where I'm going to sit everything so that I'm not just grabbing up. Okay, so I made it back in with my phone on the charger real quick so I can show you everything I got. Strawberries to snack with. Where is that glow coming from? Something right here. Oh, that's the tripod. We don't care. <laughs> I grabbed some strawberries and some pineapples. I'm going to snack on this and this tonight while I watch a movie. I'm trying to like... Just do a little bit better when it comes to what I'll choose to like snack on and stuff like that. Waiting for the play with this all day. Pineapples, chocolate dip. This is the dip I normally use to just like dip these straight into it. You don't really have to let it sit or anything, or I don't. I just like dip and eat. It's not any directions anyway. Oh, I should have got sticks to put them on. Uh, get it to it. <laughs> oh no, wait, because I got this cute heart bowls that I got from Amazon so I may put my chocolate dip in there that ain't gonna be enough that might be enough depending on how many I eat so yeah I'm gonna probably put it in this and watch me a little movie I'm probably gonna actually catch up on Narcos I grab some more milk I hang these in my well this is gonna be my first time having this brand I can't think of the other brand I normally I normally get my little sister boom when I first had got here told me about it throw them hang these in your closet since your bathroom is connected you know how you turn on the vent that little loud vent when you shower to make sure like the steam don't get too crazy. But I do turn that on. I like to hang these up in my closet and they're on a little hanger here and it absorbs the moisture. Like you'd be surprised how much it absorbs. I just hang that in there to not like mess up my clothes or anything. Uh, cleaning sponges for the kitchen. Cause I threw that other one out. It started looking ugly. Suja digestion shot, immunity shots. So basically you just kind of drink these. The digestion one has ginger, apple cider vinegar, cayenne pepper and live probiotics so i drink like one of these a day immunity one has ginger turmeric acerola cherry hold on because y'all ain't even gonna play with me that's what we not gonna do when you don't know something make it your business to find out girl this her fifth time hello you've reached destiny you reached your limit also so please leave a message after the tone beep i didn't really sound like my voicemail <laughs> she thought it was my voicemail you said what? I'm gonna call y'all back. What was I? If I was saying something, I forgot. Oh yeah, we were looking up how to pronounce that. <laughs> Acerola cherry. Acerola. Acerola cherry. Black probiotics and then this one has black pepper. This one is no joke. Like, so you can either drink this at the start of your day and then I also have the digestion shot. There aren't any directions even when you check the website as to where you should, where you should take these and all of that. I normally just do the digestion one at the end of the night. I'm pretty regular. Nothing's TMI to me. Y'all should know that by now. Um, plus, being regular is like a blessing. Like, people don't be regular. No shade. Even with me. Ah! I drink this one at night. Not like all the time. Just like when I kind of stock back up and I have these, I may just randomly grab one. Like tonight, I'm going to do the digestion one. In the morning, I might do this one. Um, then I might skip a day. Then I might do it again. It's nothing to like overthink. Just kind of like when you go in the fridge, if you want one, drink one. So with the digestion one, like in the morning, I will like... You know go but even without this i'm pretty regular but as far as me when i was saying in the car i could tell when i don't have my shots as far as just like bloating and things like that 
So yeah, I like the this for the apple cider in this one. Just when you go outside. <laughs> Anything that just helps to keep your immune system up for me. Um, it's like a plus and I love things like that. More Kleenex. I got the Bowhouse Farms breakfast smoothie. This is just good to grab like on the go when I'm heading out. Don't got time to cook, but I want something to eat or drink. I love these for breakfast. The Jimmy Dean. This one is bacon and then this one is the meat lovers one. And it comes with real eggs basically be in and out the door things like this come in handy when i'm editing too don't get me wrong i don't think i vlogged it but like literally all of last week i was like getting up and cooking breakfast like i'm a breakfast girl even if i don't show y'all all the time i'm always cooking myself breakfast i also got my nephew this it's for his light oh look at this it's so cute so it's like a bell but it's not belling you ain't think to check it into the store, Destiny. Okay, is it broke? I got this sweater. Cause it was cute. I got it in a medium girl, so I hope it fits. With the little buttons on it. Some jeans or something. Y'all know this color is just like it for fall. Like I love this color. It's real neutral. You can do it, you can do this with brown, you can do it with burgundy, you can do it with burnt orange, like you can do this with a lot. The sack boy, a big adventure game for my nephew because he's turning six. Oh my God, my nephew six. If I don't come back, the rest of my plans for the night is going to be a shower. I'm glad it's not. I love when I have a no makeup day. Getting situated for bed is so much quicker. Do my skincare routine and then I'm going to chill. I don't know if I'm gonna chill on the couch or if I'm gonna chill in my room. I may chill on the couch because my bed, excuse me, my bed is so comfortable like as soon as I get in bed and I think I'm gonna watch something, give me 10 minutes and I'm out. I've been falling asleep by like 10.30. And I know I'm gonna be up to like 11.30 trying to watch some on TV. Like, why are you sleep already? Why? Cause I'm pretty sure I'm gonna eat this whole thing. Signal was bad in that place. I don't post to my Instagram story in real time. It's just not safe to do so. Um, well, I don't location tag that much either, but if I wanted to post in real time, my story wouldn't have even went through. I always just film directly in my phone and then post. Like once I'm settled, situated. So that's what I'm gonna do now, put my dinner post up. Plus I don't like to post fast. Like I wanna be able to type the words that I want if you wanna find any GIFs and things like that. Especially like if you're out with family or friends, I don't like to be steady just in my phone trying to find like all the cute stuff I wanna put on my story. I'd rather just save it until I get home. So it's right in here and then I could just pick what I want and put it on my story. And I also need to finish the description box because I know I said in the vlog that I was gonna link some things. And yeah, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow for Mr. Lincoln's birthday. <laughs> if I don't vlog tomorrow, I'm pretty sure my sister will. Um, no my I most likely document from my point of view when I see my nephew after school. So <laughs> okay, bought a peak at a pillar porch. Three peas popcorn porch. Let's drink. 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 let us I think I got this from Marshalls. Cause I know y'all gonna ask. Oh, Ross. I've been taking on all this baggage, adding on so much weight. Have you thinking that I was average when you really don't play? get them south coasters to go here anyways i'm running the aesthetic about talking right now jayla back don't play with it 